everybody, this is Britt, and we, it is um, early August, and we have been in Canada about four days, I guess, uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, yeah, and we are in, uh, on the outskirts of Ottawa, and today we're going to go into Ottawa to Parliament Hill and some museums, so we're really excited about uh, what will happen today. We've been doing some hard miles because we're uh, still quite a ways from Nova Scotia, etc., and uh, we can feel the fall coming on already here in Canada. It's going to be kind of a gloomy day, but that seems like the weather here, so we'll just deal with that. And uh, we're also going to talk about a new strategy we have for decision making, which I think you'll appreciate. Stay tuned. So here we are, we've just arrived at Parliament Hill and Britt's filming. Honey, look at that beautiful building. Okay. We're on a nice plaza in, uh, across the street, across Wellington Street, from the central Parliament building. Uh, so what we've been noticing is, as our travels uh, continued, that having some difficulty with decision making and when that happens usually I end up doing all the deciding and at one point I uh, really kind of said I don't want to do this anymore and it was little things like where, if we should eat out or not or when to stop for the night or how far to travel during the day. So Stephen came up with this uh, method that's really working for us for making decisions, so tell us about it. Okay. Yeah, uh, I decided, or I, I proposed that we have five votes each, and if you're really wedded to an idea, you can throw your entire five votes and say, I just gotta have it. Or if you're just kind of, kind of casual about it, you can give three of your votes towards something, and the other person either matches three to three, and you can vote again, or we have a deadlock breaker, which is go rock, paper, scissors, and then oddly, I hope it's oddly, the loser has to decide, because deciding is a chore. Right. That I've been getting out of it, but I can't get out of it anymore. But I don't mind because I can still vacillate to the number of votes I'm going to throw behind something. And it makes it comfortable for both of us. Every decision we've made since we initiated this program has been just married. Yeah, really easy. And um, it really helps me clarify how strongly I feel about something, too. So there's really value in that. And I know how strongly Brit feels about something because I've been taking her uh, one vote towards something that it was kind of very important to her. But it may not be uh, as important as I had previously thought. 